Hello everybody, I'm back. I want to do a quick video here. Um, look what we got. Uh, just a couple hours ago. Um, we have some eggs in our brooder here. Uh, actually, this is our incubator. Uh, we have a new one, uh, a little bit larger. And I have some uh, fertile cockatiel eggs there that are going to hatch within the next couple of days probably. And I have a couple, uh, just to get, show you some size differences, um, I had to pull a couple McCall eggs, and so there's a couple eggs uh, from a pair of McCalls that we have. Um, so anyway, uh, this guy was peeping in the middle of the night when I got up to check on him, and I knew it was just going to be a matter of hours, and so um, gave him all the right conditions. He had the right amount of humidity, um, and he just pecked his way out, and everything worked perfectly, and we didn't have to assist or do anything like that. So I'll keep you guys updated on this one. Um, we're not sure what it is. It obviously has yellow fuzz, so we know it's not a white face. So um, we'll keep you posted, and uh, obviously I'll show you what we do from day one on feeding these guys. I, I get tons of questions about people that have this happen and they're not sure that their birds are feeding their babies and they want to take over feeding them and what to do and how to do it. Uh, we're going to take this um, little series here and we're going to walk through that. Um, so I'm going to let him go for about eight hours or so. You can see he's already used the bathroom. That's the first thing that we look for. Uh, but we want him to go uh, for about mm, six to eight hours anyway. And make sure that he's completely empty of everything from inside the egg that's sucked up into him once he hatches. And then once all of that is uh, passed through him, then we'll go ahead and we'll start feeding him hand formula. And I'll, uh, I'll show you what we use, and I'll show you uh, how we mix it, and um, how to feed this guy from the start. And I get tons of questions on this kind of stuff all the time. And that's okay. That's what we're here for. If you have questions, ask. That's what we're here for. So there's a couple of uh, McCall eggs compared to a cockatiel egg. Um, and a Lubberg eggs are even smaller than that. So anyway, uh, that's our new addition for the day. I'll keep you guys posted. Um, please hit like, subscribe. It does help. And uh, we'll keep making uh, these uh, bird videos for you. And I hope you guys are having a great day, and we'll talk soon. See you.